Hi, my name is Eric Yeager, Regional Sales Agronomist out of Mapleton, Minnesota for CFS. Today I'm going to be talking about response to nitrogen on high, medium, and low. So response to nitrogen is a tool that we use to manage in-season decisions or fall decisions, whatever it might be. Let's say you have a piece of ground, or if you're a farmer that has a piece of ground that maybe does not have a lot of tile, maybe it's a rented piece, stays a little bit wetter in season, you're going to be wanting to consider some of these management decisions based on the condition of some of your ground and how wet it stays or how fast it dries out. So let's say you are someone that has that rented acre, and if you have a year like we're having this year, we have excess moisture that we are not able to get rid of very quickly, So because it just keeps raining and raining. So let's say you are in that position, you're gonna maybe wanna consider a hybrid with a low response to nitrogen. So when conditions happen such as this year and we aren't able to get out into the field to apply our nitrogen in season, if that is your management choice, let's say you have 150 pounds that you put down in the fall via anhydrous, urea, or whatever it might be, come back with 30 pounds in the spring and then maybe follow up with another 30 to 40 pounds variable rate in season via side dress. Well, let's say we're not able to do that. So we go down, we start decreasing our total end throughout the year. So if you have a response to nitrogen on the low side on a certain hybrid, as you decrease that nitrogen, the yield slope going down is gonna be a lot less than something with, let's say, a high response to nitrogen. As you decrease that, that nitrogen in the ground there, the yield slope goes down a lot more tremendously than a response to nitrogen on the medium side or on the low side. Now on the opposite side, maybe you wanna choose a response to nitrogen hybrid on the high side, so you can manage it in season the way you want to. Let's say you're a guy that likes his nitrogen, maybe you put 180 pounds on in the fall and you come back and you put 20 to 30 pounds on the spring and maybe you side dress if you need it. Well, if you're managing like that, uh, response to nitrogen on the high side for a certain hybrid might be the choice for you because as you manage that and increase that nitrogen for that hybrid, the yield response going up is going to respond a lot better to that in-season nitrogen or just nitrogen in general than let's say a medium to low response to nitrogen hybrid would. So that's kind of my basic story on RTN. If you have any other questions about it, you can contact your local CFS agronomist. Thank you.